Hello and welcome back to the Khel Now Team of the Round. We are here today with the Team of the Round 6. I'm subbing again for Guru Dino. I'm Abhishek Parmeshwaran. He's busy showing the ISL matches as well to our young footballers at our mutineers. Well, what we have in Round 6 is basically Chennai not playing a single game. Mumbai City played two games and we had some exciting, very, very close encounters, particularly between Delhi and Atletico de Kolkata. We bring you our Team of the Round. Uh, the first player on the team is the goalkeeper Subrata Pal. India's national team goalkeeper Subrata Pal yet again makes our team of the round. India's Spider-Man currently is the golden glove holder in the ISL with two clean sheets. Very much an informed goalkeeper for an informed team. So we move on to the right back position and at that position is Ashutosh Mehta from Mumbai City FC. Ashutosh Mehta is one who has quietly risen to prominence. He puts in steady performances week in week out for Mumbai City FC and he puts in a good shift for them at the back. Up next is Pavel Shimovs, again from Mumbai City FC. He has been rock at the heart of defence along with Darren O'Day. The next centre-back is Anas Erathodika from Delhi Dynamos FC. The 28-year-old Anas is answering critics in the best way possible, on the football pitch. He helped to keep a clean sheet for his side against Atletico de Kolkata. The next person in our defence is Nikki Shori at the left-back position. David Platt noticed a weakness in KBFC and he played Nikki Shori higher up than usual. Three assists from that sweet left leg. Next up is midfield and the first person in our midfield is Franz Burton from France and he plays for Mumbai City FC. Franz Burton got a goal against North East United FC and he helped nullify their attack while playing in the base of midfield. The next person in our midfield is Florent Maluda from France again and he plays for Delhi Dynamos FC. The former Chelsea man is tireless and very very creative. He chipped in at the very end with an assist in the 94th minute for Dos Santos' goal against ATK. A fantastic signing by Delhi Dynamos FC. The next person in our midfield is on the right side of midfield and it is Tunchai Sandy. The Turk is another one who keeps running all game and he scored the vital winner against Kerala Blasters FC in a 3-2 win. A fantastic performance by Tunchai Sandy. The next person in our midfield is again Sunil Chetri. What can you say about Sunil Chetri? He is now the leading goal scorer in the Hero ISL with 6 goals. He bagged himself a hat-trick against North East United FC. What a leader. The next person in our midfield is Mohammad Rafi from Kerala Blasters FC. The under-18 Mohammad Rafi scored a brace against FC Pune City. Both goals were headers. He now has four goals in the competition. We move on to the striker and this week it's Kalu Uche from FC Pune City. The Nigerian who formerly played for Levante got two goals against Kerala Blasters FC and he was a standout attacker on display. The manager for this round is Nicolas Anelka and he will employ a formation of 4-4-1-1 with Sunil Chetri as the number 10. Nicolas Anelka was a standout manager on display, picking up 6 points out of a possible 6. He'll be looking forward to making that semi-final slot. We'll be back with the team of the round 7. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment and share and let us know your views. See you next time.